Hi, Tim Skell here, ABB HVAC Application Engineering. Today we're going to take a look at what do you do if you got an ACH 580 VFD, you're starting it up and you see the motor's going the wrong direction. So to, typically what's going to happen is you give her a bump in hand, you're watching your shaft, oh, I'm going the wrong direction, shut her down. That's not the way I want to be moving. So what do I do? Well, option one, a little bit more time consuming and traditional is I do my lockout tag out. I go ahead and swap two motor wires around, any two phases on the output side of a VFD, and then uh, go ahead and start the equipment up, give another test, and I'll be going in the right direction. So that's option one. A little bit more time consuming to go through that lockout tag out, physically swap wires around, especially when you're talking about some high, heavier gauge wire on, on higher horsepower VFDs and motors. So alternate solution is come to menu, primary settings, I'm going to come down to motor and I've got this phase order right here. I've got this UVW or I can electronically swap two motors around, go to UWV, hit save. Now when I run my drive in my motor, the motor is going to go in the opposite direction of what it originally was. So a really cool trick to get the motor going in the right direction without having to lock out, tag out and swap motors around. Couple uh, pro tips on this. One is this does get backed up into the control panel of the drive. So let's say this drive was to fail five, 10 years from now and you put a new ACH 580 in its place. As soon as you pull the parameters from this control panel and put them in a new drive, the drive will know to say, hey, we've got these phases electrically swapped around. So you don't have to worry about having to go in the wrong direction on the replacement drive. Uh, the other gotcha on this, I'm assuming a VFD only. If I got a VFD and bypass, then I have other variables involved in making sure the bypass is running in the right direction also. So this tip here, this, this really cool trick is for a VFD only. If you have any questions, reach out to your local ABB representative or your ABB factory application engineer. Thank you.